So we made it to the Napoli Airport. We did. Naples Airport. Napoli. Oh, we have what, about 40 minutes? 30, 30 minutes? 30 minutes. So naturally, we gravitated to the only thing that seemed to make sense. This guy. Yeah, like, the way this stuff moves is like crazy. <laughs> and I really want to eat it. So this is approximately three minutes later. No, nah, more, more like two and a half minutes later from the last post. <laughs> Verdict? Probably the best airport pizza I'll ever have. I also forgot to mention this cost five euro and they made it in front of our eyes in five minutes. Five euros, five minutes. Five stars. Two, two, two <laughs> happy cows. For an airport. <laughs> Yeah. So we've made it to our beautiful villa here in Sorrento. Yeah, they weren't lying about the view here. Check that out. What are your uh, initial thoughts here? Uh, it's really pretty. I want to move here. I need to learn more Italian so I can do that. I'm gonna get some dinner on the docks later. Yeah, I get some seafood. How are you feeling about this little walk we got here down to the city? Uh, it's oh. quite nice going down, actually. Going up is gonna be more interesting. <laughs> yeah. Look at this sunset we are treated to. All right, so we're here at a Soul in Fish, our first dinner. What we liked is we came here and we basically said, choose your fish over here. <laughs> yeah. Catch of the day, choose this, and we'll give you like three different sauces and like methods of how to cook it. Yeah. And we'll just cook it for you and you can share a fish and it'll be great. <laughs> yeah. So we're excited to see how that turns out. Our fish, yeah. uh, unfortunately, has already left. That's the building. To get, uh, to get grilled up. Yeah. <laughs> how many of these fish do you do every day? <laughs> <laughs> A lot. Last year in August, we did uh, something like. 800 kilos. What? Wow. Oh my god. All in August. <laughs> and that's one month. <laughs> yeah. Different, all different kinds of fish. Wow. That's the skill of thousands of kilos of fish. <laughs> so there it is. All ready to be consumed. So much skill goes into not only cooking it, but preparing um, it. Love. Do you wanna give yours a try there? I do, I really do. <laughs> Start with the potato, so you know, general idea of the flavor. She, it's so good she's laughing. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Like, some of the potato has this caramelized crust on the outside. It's like buttery but also lemony, so it's fresh, it's not too heavy. You're eating the really well you're eating the ocean right now. It's really tender, really good. Great. Alright, can't wait for mine. So here we are walking down this crazy hill again. We decided to have kind of a relaxing day, not do too much, just like go down to Sorrento. Enjoy more of these views that I don't think I could ever get tired of in my life. Gonna eat some good food. Yeah, try to eat some good food. What's our plan? Just uh, relax a bit. What do you say? Relaxing Frank? and max. Maxing and relax. That's what I meant. Oh, watch out. Shoot. And we almost died. 
it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we're now in the middle of downtown Sorrento. That's so cute. All these little alleys and shops around, cafes, lots of food, which we are looking for first, of course. Yes. It's a nice little Italian feel. We are in Italy. Probably sound very American right now. <laughs> Brutish Americans. So we've made it to our lunch spot. Beautiful little canopy area we're in. First dish is a uh, stuffed zucchini flour. Let's get at it. Course number two. <laughs> ravioli. Yeah, ravioli non rosso. I think it means like a cream sauce that's got a little bit of marinara in it mm -hmm. to make it red. And seafood pasta. All of the seafood in the world. <laughs> so we walk into the shop and it's like really hard to express how bright this room is. It's like really nuts. How does this room make you feel? Everything. <laughs> Everything and nothing. Carrying a little lemon. Sorry. Breaking the rules. Yeah, this is just one of like probably 50 stores like this in Sorrento. Just lemons are their thing and they make no apologies for it. Citrus. God. Next up on the food hit parade in Sorrento. All right, Sintonio. Our cab driver from the bus slash train station recommended this place to us. Apparently it has some really good seafood risotto, so I got that. I just got some uh, like fresh fish of the day being in Sorrento. All right, taxi driver. Let's see what you got. Oh. <laughs> Pretty good. And my fresh fish deboned. Thank you, sir. So if you'll see, Franklin just uh, put a fish bone down. Oh, and another one. Gonna... Let's go to recap what we were just talking about. Oh, dude, there's a third fish bone. Oh, a fourth. I'm used to putting fish bones around. Uh, we can do it ourselves. No big deal. But, there is a difference. We're guessing the A team talent has to go down by the work Because that's like all they do all the time. So they just put work in. It's like fish, Debo, fish, Debo, fish, Debo, fish. All the time. And it goes back to the conversation we had earlier. <laughs> Maybe 40% of talent will get you there. 60% of the work you're Yes. We're seeing the results of that. You can't substitute work. No, you, no, you can't. Work. Hard work, time, effort. And the guy from yesterday came over to us and asked us if everything was okay. And you pointed out that there was one bone and he was really disappointed. Like, he was upset with himself that he had left, left, left you one bone. <laughs> Dirty dozen right there. Yeah, so... 11 more than yesterday. So, you can draw your own conclusions from that. We got a live sax player downstairs. Respect, by the way. Dude, saxophone player right here. <laughs> it is Tuesday, June 13th. Good morning, y'all. We 
Bought some snazzy looking hats yesterday. Probably uh, the most touristy thing in the world. Uh, but we did it to preempt our uh, big walking day today in the Amalfi Sun. Just waiting for a bus, Sita bus. We heard they could be quite tardy and they are a few minutes late right now. Yeah. But not a big deal as long as it's, you know, not in the 15 minute range. I think I think we'll be good. So I uh, hope it'll come waiting. soon. So the bus never came, unfortunately. Could have been 15 minutes. And now we're walking on our way down. Hopefully it'll be at the Sorrento station when it says it is and we can hop on that one. We'll continue to uh, investigate this Sita bus situation. So we made it back to the bus station. Good news, we did see a bus when we got back here. Bad news, this is what we're in right now. Any thoughts? How it works, it's desirable. So we made it on the bus. You'll notice we're at a strange level. Took about two hours to get here. Uh, about 30 least, miles. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we're going like 50 miles an hour a lot, and it's like, zoom, stop, go around a really tight corner. Zoom, stop, go around a really tight corner. Oh god, there's another bus coming! There's another bus coming! Shaboom! Like that. It was actually exactly like that. <laughs> Luckily now though, we get these great views. Check it out. View of the ocean. Yeah. Incredible cruise. That you we will that. do the next time we come here. Yep, we'll be over there. Be on a green bus. Views of the beach. You want houses? Bang, up there. You want more houses? Bang, up there. You want giant sized jacks? Bang, you got them over there. <laughs> yeah, they're everywhere. We got the middle of a Amalfi here. Very cute, very cute. We've got a, a clarinet three string bass duo. Very compelling. We got guys washing their hands from a fountain coming out of the lady's breast. Also very compelling. There's a lot to take in here. I see what you did there, and I like it. We found the food. Pizza. Pasta. Little non-dairy dessert here. At least I think it's not dairy. So fresh. So fruity. Totality. Look how ripe the strawberry is, dude. I'm really cold on my hands right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I'm still gonna use it. So we are back from the mall at a restaurant known for their mozzarella. A mozzarella bar. They also have like buffalo steaks. Everything buffalo. 
So what's the first word that came to your mind when you just saw what you saw? Nah. Like nothing. Uh, is there any kind of mozzarella that is missing here? No. Wisconsin girl at heart here. So we're about halfway through this cheese dish here. Just the cheese. <laughs> And Leslie Ann uh, has not been able to control her emotions. <laughs> There's been like a lot of... I don't know, I don't even describe it. Um, it's like looking up to the heavens for an explanation of how good this is. There's no um, explanation, it's just good. Um, so much happiness, a laughing. Uh, on <laughs> the verge of tears. What do you think? Inspiration for Han Solo, perhaps? <laughs>